Uh, uh, come in. Uh, the, the, uh, communication from the Pentagon, sir. Uh, Ranakai uh, Island has been selected as a site for a motion picture by Naval Public Relations. Naval Public Relations, motion picture here. Take over the champagne, Beasley. Oh, oh, uh, oh yes. <laughs> There, see, I got it, sir, without missing a stroke. Yes, this is the Blue Daniel. <laughs> According to this, a <laughs> Lieutenant Mark Clay from Naval <laughs> Public Relations should be arriving tomorrow morning. Good. Well, I, however, forewarned is forearmed, you know. Camouflage, everything necessary. Oh, about your golf course, sir? I want gun emplacements put into every sand trap. <laughs> come in, come in, come in. Come in, come in. Uh, request permission to speak to the commander, sir. All right, all right, very well. What is it, McGuire? What is it? We're going to go right ahead. Sir, oh, tomorrow is Lieutenant Morgan's birthday, and we yes, wanted to... Yes, you'd like me to contribute? To, well, all right, fine. Put me down for 50 cents. Oh, well, that's very generous of you, sir. I only had you down for a quarter. <laughs> what we came to ask you is permission to take tomorrow afternoon off for a surprise birthday party. Negative, negative, negative. One thing you swabets must understand, a Navy supply base does not cease functioning just because somebody has a birthday. Oh, oh but sir, all we want to do is show Lieutenant Morgan no, a no. good time. You no, know, take a few just... pictures to send home, no. have a few laughs. Pictures? You, you, you mean like home movies? Home? What is it? What's come over at me? Has this war changed me that much for heaven's sake? I don't... Yes, it has. I may as well admit it. I've just turned into a cruel, heartless, selfish type of fellow. And after all, we may have to be here on this desert island for, for, for just years and years and years. At the very least I can do is to start acting like a Human being, for goodness sake. Yes, yes, of course, she can. Tell dear Lieutenant Morgan you can have the party. You can turn the air. No, I know you want me to do. We can have it. You can have it on the beach. A sort of a beach, a luau, and you can all wear sarong. <laughs> sarong? <laughs> now, fine. Now, now, just one thing more. I, I don't let Lieutenant Morgan know that I had any part in this at all. It's just that, it, well, sometime, perhaps, after the war, you could whisper my name in her ear. We understand, Commander. Okay. Fine. Okay. <laughs> oh. yeah. Sir. That fiendish chuckle tells me that we are off on another mad prank. Mad, but ingenious, Beasley. Now, you see, we will let this Lieutenant Clay take his pictures, then we will take our pictures. The vulgarism for that, I believe, is the old switcheroo. Uh, <laughs> then, poof, go the way. Oh, 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 listen, I, I'm, I'm sorry, sir. I, I, I was thinking the Blue Danube, and suddenly I went in to hold that tiger. <laughs> but I'm afraid we're going to have to cut up the cake later. We've got to get this work out or we're going to play right into the hands of Commander Killjoy. I don't know. Even Commander Adrian could have a change of heart. Change of heart? <laughs> he doesn't even have one. If he did, he'd turn it in for an extra stomach. <laughs> come along, chaps. Come along, come along, come along. 
Lieutenant Morgan, I would like to introduce to you Lieutenant Clay of Naval Public Relations. Well, how do you do? Hello. Well, if, if this isn't the most charming party. Stanley, you have created another masterpiece. Let me see what it says. It, happy birthday, Lieutenant <laughs> Morgan. <laughs> it's on, Lieutenant, may I extend to you my very best wishes, and I hope you will have a lovely day. Thank you, sir. I'd like to toss in a few happies myself. Well, feel free. Now, would someone explain to me what all the uh, movie equipment is for? He will explain. Come along, Stanley. Please. Beasley. Beasley. I'll get him for you. Beasley, heel! <laughs> oh, oh uh, yeah, yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Oh, that's nothing. You should see him fetch. Now, uh, Lieutenant, what's the uh, photographic pitch? Well, Public Relations is doing a film on supply lines in the South Pacific. I've been assigned to cover activities in this area. You mean uh, make a movie of us while we're working? Yes. Me and the movies. Oh, no. Look at me. I I'm a mess. So for once, we'll start even. <laughs> I'll request permission to take a facial. <laughs> All right, shipmates. Stow it. I don't think the lieutenant is here to film Gone with the Wind, right? Right. It's a sensor. You all look very natural. Now, why don't you just uh, uh, go on about your work and pretend I'm not here? I'll uh, be ready in a minute. <laughs> oh, Selma, darling, may I borrow your screwdriver? Here you go, lovey, and uh, don't forget where you got it. <laughs> Would uh, one of you mind fixing the hinge on that windshield? I'll fix it, ma'am. No, let me. Spread out, will you? I can fix it. You all look better. Hold it, Lieutenant. Freeze! <laughs> all right, Lieutenant. Now, um, I don't think the little scheme of Commander Adrian's is going to work. Come again? Now, let me see if I've got it right. You take movies of the waves at work. They all act like Academy Award losers. Adrian gets the film, shows it to the Admiral, and we're all shipped out for inefficiency, correct? <laughs> What's so funny, Lieutenant? Let me show you something. <laughs> it's empty. No, Bill? Well, I, I don't understand. It's my gimmick. I let my subject get all that jazz out of this system. After that, I usually get good material. <laughs> How about it? You got it. Now, also, my apologies for mistrusting you. All right. Now, hear this. We're going to cut the ham right down to the bone. You read me? <laughs> to the waves. <laughs> Commander, you should see this film. The way those waves fix those vehicles, bing, bang. You must be very proud of it. I am. I truly am. I, every night I pray, take care of the waves. Isn't that right? <laughs> oh, uh, uh, true, sir. Uh, yes, that's, that's true. I, I, I mean, uh, the, the waves have the commander down on his knees every minute. <laughs> well, I better get this off as soon as I can. Oh, no, no, not, not so quick. No, no, no. Not till after the Admiral, please. The Admiral? They have tightened up security regulations around here quite a bit. You know, we're, we're only 850 miles from the fighting front. It is touch and go. But, uh, but never me, no buts. Conflict makes no exceptions in these matters. Well, very well, sir. Uh, I'll have to have a receipt from you, though. Oh, <laughs> Don't need any red tape between us. I'll, I'll give you my word. It's a gentleman. <laughs> well, I wonder what's holding up lunch. Ah, yeah, uh, uh, oh, oh, uh, oh, if you'll oh, excuse sorry. me. I've been selected to deliver Lieutenant Morgan to a surprise party at the beach. Uh, you have? You're going to deliver... I, I hope I haven't inconvenienced you. Don't be silly. Don't be silly. Don't be silly. Don't be silly. Lieutenant, don't worry. Don't worry about that at all. You go along. have lots of fun. You, you deserve it, Lieutenant. Bye. Ah, ah, Beasley. Now we can make our own home movies. Ah, uh, you mean, the, you mean the, the sending the waves home movies? Oh, very, very, very well put, Beasley. Oh, uh, sir, I think that you've got them this time. I mean, I really take my hat off to you. How do you do it, sir? How do you do it? Well, well, Beasley, when it comes to the extermination of the waves, I <laughs> lie a lot. Uh. <laughs> Where are you taking me? Just a minute, be patient. Uh, pardon? It? What's happening? Ready? Now. Surprise! Surprise! <laughs> what? 
Well, I don't know what to say. Well, don't say anything. Just put this on and we'll all look like Dorothy L'Amour. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> speak for yourself, Selma. <laughs> Come on, Selma, you baste the chickens. Okay. I'm delighted. You have done a remarkable job. <laughs> Thank you, sir. I, I, I always was mechanically inclined, even as a child. <laughs> oh, those those dear golden days of Tinker Toy. <laughs> Knock it off. Just let's get started, shall we, Beasley? Uh, well, now, sir, um, now, 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 when, when I uh, say action, you see, uh, you enter, and, and, and you have to uh, speak up loudly, sir, because uh, your voice has to be picked up by this little microphone. Here. All right? Okay, ready? Action! <laughs> oh, Lieutenant Morgan, I wonder if you would be so kind... Oh, <laughs> good gracious, what a mess. I wonder where the waves are. <laughs> Hmm. Here it is. Uh, one o'clock in the afternoon of a working day. <laughs> and the waves are not here. Where could they be at one o'clock in the afternoon of a working day? <laughs> Beasley! Ensign Beasley! <laughs> uh, did you call, sir? Yes, Beasley. Where are the waves? They're d down at the beach, sir. Like they always are. Every afternoon at one o'clock on a working day, <laughs> sir. Oh, well, I hope for their sake that you are wrong, Ensign Beasley. Well, well, we will go and see. By the way, Ensign Beasley, what time is it? It is one o'clock in the afternoon of a working day, <laughs> sir. Beasley! Heel! Tahua ula oa wa tahua ula Ihu ihu la o pika luka la hulu Puka tiko la ika tuka la Ahinu paro la uhule Quick, get out your light meter and get a reading. I don't want any slip-ups. Come on, come on, come on, sir. Uh, uh, it's closer to you, sir. What does it say? 130. Sir, what? It's a simple mistake, sir. Uh, oh, yes, right here. Here. So, oh, sir, look! My Boy Scout knife, I thought I lost it. I did all that crying for nothing. Beasley, hurry, hurry, sir. hurry. We're losing the time. Right? Uh, now, the lens cap, Beasley. Remove the lens cap. <laughs> That is delicious. It is delicious. delicious. Are, are you getting all this beef? <laughs> sir, sir, uh, would it be all right to snip a few wallet sizes out of this? It wouldn't take long. Sir, sir, what's, oh, what's wrong? Was it something that I said? No, Beakley. I was just thinking what it'll be like around here without the waves. I always cry when I'm happy. <laughs> more, Beakley. Take more pictures. More. <laughs> Ready when you are. Well, I'm all ready, sir. Uh, 
Time, I wonder how much I'll get off of good behavior. <laughs> Sorry, Mark. I think Adrian just dragged you along for the ride. Yeah. To think he gave me his word as a gentleman. Gentleman? Huh, you should have picked a different category. Yeah, I'd just like to fix him a nitroglycerin cocktail followed by a sharp rap on a skull. <laughs> now that's something you could sell tickets to. You do it, now film it. <laughs> hey, that's it. Uh, now, wait a minute, Lieutenant. I know it'd be justifiable homicide, but... No, no, Kowalski. <laughs> Pictures. Film. Get it? We've got all day tomorrow before the Admiral gets here. We'll take our own pictures of Adrian. Capiche? Of course, we're going to need a lot of technical help. Oh, you've got it. He's got me over the same barrel. Oh, good. <laughs> Gather around, everybody. <laughs> Stanley, <laughs> three bottles of wine. Yeah, without labels. Now, how am I supposed to cook with them if I don't know what they are? Well, you expect me to tell you, huh? Well, certainly. Go ahead, take a sip. You're the big wine connoisseur. You really think I can do it, eh? Just between you and me, you're the best wino I ever met. <laughs> I'm going to accept that as a compliment. Yeah, here we go, then. Let me see how this goes. You go right ahead. I'll take notes. <laughs> Oh, that is definitely, that is a Beaujolais, Beaujolais Fleury. <laughs> now, this one is a, well, that one's that one. And, uh, let's see now. The, ah, this. Mm. Oh, that's a Chablis. And I can tell that's a Chablis because Chablis is white and Beaujolais is red. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, what about this one? Let's make a little more of it. That's nummy. <laughs> no, 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 Botnik. You gotta hear the snap. If you don't hear the crack, then you're doing it wrong. Oh, it's obvious you'll just never make a decent flogger. <laughs> well, Stanley, what's going on here? I, right, you're... Oh, uh, what's this? Oh, uh, oh, this. Oh, uh, this is a bullwhip. Used to belong to my great, 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 great grandfather back in Kansas. See, he and my great, 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 great grandmother used to drive ten stubborn mules with this bullwhip. Oh, that's very interesting. Mule yeah. skinners, eh? Now, now, what mule skinners? They had ten kids. <laughs> I'm just trying to show this clown how to snap this bullwhip, but he just doesn't have the build for it. No. <laughs> Why don't you show him how to do it? Oh, well. I... Now, you, you watch him and you'll see a real he-man do it. Well, <laughs> Of course, if, if, if you insist, it's been some time uh, since I've done this. However, the trick is all in the action of the wrist. You see, you have to... You did it! I did it. <laughs> Do it again! Uh, it's, it, it's all in the... Wrist. Once more. Already. Bravo! Is it any wonder why we love this man? Bravo, bravo! You see a real He-Man? Did you well, that? It does appear that my old timing is coming back. Here, Botnik, I tell you what you do. You take this little pad of matches, hold them in your teeth, and I'll light them one at a time. Go ahead. Uh-oh. Ready for phase two. <laughs> Rattlesnake! 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 It's, it's, it's a 
in the bush there, Commander. Give him a good hit with the whip. Send that boy. I will sever that reptilian head from that squiggling body. <laughs> Shall I put the matches in his mouth? <laughs> Here, take this, sir, in case of snake bite. The snake doesn't live that bites Roger Adrian. Yeah, well, that's one way to kill snakes. <laughs> All right, now, this is how it works. See, I took the film of Adrian with a whip. Now, I spliced it together with the film I took of you girls just a little while ago. Now, watch. <laughs> wow! That's marvelous. And all the other movies you took of us will splice together in the same way? Precisely. Boy, can't you just see Adrian's face? I never could see his face. <laughs> how long will it take, Mark? Uh, give me an hour and you can put the show on the road. Oh, good! <laughs> How are you coming, Bisley? Oh, I've almost got it, sir. Well, there's no hurry. The Admiral isn't due for another 30 minutes. Just let me run this through. Right. Hmm? Sir! Hmm? Sir! 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 What are you doing? I'm dying, sir! The reverse! The reverse! <laughs> Easily, <laughs> sometimes I'm convinced you are bucking for a section eight. <laughs> come in, come in. Sir, some additional film for the Admiral to see? You know, security regulations? Oh, later, perhaps later. Oh, you really ought to see it, sir. It's very interesting. Mm -hmm. I had no idea you were so photogenic. I? You, you took pictures of me? Well, yes. Oh. The real you. Hard at work. Like the waves. <laughs> you might call it, uh, selected short subjects. <laughs> Shall we? Oh. Throw your roll of blackmail into the flames, and I'll follow suit with this little saga of Muscle Beach. Oh, no, sir. I think in this case, I would say gentlemen first. Oh, you just don't trust me. Oh, how perceptive of you. Oh, oh, hi ho. Well, here we go. Got you now, Lieutenant. That roll of film I just dropped into the fire was a phony. <laughs> Here is the real McCoy on you. Oh, sir, I sort of figured that. Mine was a phony, too. <laughs> and here is the real McCoy on you. <laughs> Shall we? <laughs> you can't win. You just can't win. 